Kia ora tato. welcome back to the Wargaming Den. This week's game of Kings of War pits my elves against Josh's goblins. The mission we're going to be playing is Raze, and as usual we're playing at 2000 points. Let's have a look at my army list this week. Made a few changes. The Oamaru Onslaught competition that I'm organising is being held this upcoming weekend, and so this is the final list that I've decided upon. I'm the TO, so I wasn't intending on playing, um, but I've been the swing player if there are any last minute um, changes. And we've had a couple of people drop out, so to keep the numbers at a nice even 10, I'll be playing as well as organising things. So. Um, we'll see how that goes. So let's have a look at the changed list. So it's still got the two Palace Guard regiments. It's got the Sea Guard Horde with the Hammer of Measured Force. Quicksilver Lancers are still there. They've got Sir Jesse's Boots of Striding. First change I've made is I've taken the Silver Breeze Regiment and given them a brew of strength. Not as um, tough going forward as the Stormwind Cavalry, but they do have missiles. They're nimble, so hopefully they'll be a bit of a handful. The Elven King on the mount, and I've given him the Axe of Giant Slayer. He's probably one of my favourite units zipping around the battlefield. I enjoy using him. I've kept the two Wizards. One's got Lightning Bolt and the Veil of Shadows, but it's been downgraded to two, so I could squeeze an Axe of Giant Slayer. And he's got, or she's got, the Inspiring Talisman. The other Wizard has simply got a Lightning Bolt. Plan being that the, the Wizard with the Inspiring Talisman can sit behind the... Um, Sea Guard and use Veil of Shadows, etc. And then I've got the um, Killer's Hunter formation again with Dracon Lord and two Dracon Regiments. So I've got quite a bit of um, nimble in the list. Let's see if I can figure out at last how to use it effectively. And let's have a look at Josh's Goblins. This is the same army that he's used a few times now. He was thinking about making some changes to the mints and mobs, maybe taking two troops rather than one troop and one regiment or horde. I'm not quite sure what size it is there. But he's got his Goblin Rebel Horde, the two sharp stick regiments, his two troll hordes are the, the heavy hitters. He's got his magwans, he's got the mints and mob troop, which has got skirmisher boots, so it's quite nimble. The regiment or the horde of mincers, which are quite dangerous. Two more pup launchers and the sharp stick thrower is still there. The wing it with bombs away. That's um, rather annoying usually. He's got the Troll Bruiser, who we nicknamed Barry the Bruiser in this week's game. He's got Grony, of course, um, and Grony's backed up by the Wizard on a Moor Beast with that host of Shadow Beasts, so you've got to watch out for him. And he's got the Goblin King with Jareth's Pendant, which I think gives Headstrong to nearby units as an aura. So um, it's a, an effective list it's got a few units that he can afford to lose while still coming forward the elves on the other hand are outnumbered 16 units to 11 so i can't afford to lose too many so let's see how this week's game shapes up and let's have a look at deployment mission is raise each player puts three objectives on the opposing side of the table so mine are here here and here Josh's are here, here, and here. The middle one doesn't move at all. Um, you can claim the objectives you place on the other side of the board at the end of a turn, um, and you get a victory point for those. So there's four victory points in total um, in this particular mission. I lined up the bulk of my forces on my right flank. I've got the Sea Guard. They're just touching the hill, ready to advance on top of it, protected on their flanks by the Palace Guard. My Dracon's over there. Quicksilver Lancers and the King in the centre. I'm wanting them to whiz round and grab that objective and the King to try and take out some of the war machines. My Dracons and Dracon Lord over here. The Trolls and the Winget, they want to grab that objective. He's got a Bruiser and some sharp sticks here. And Josh has got the bulk of his force out this side, wanting to take those two objectives out there. Josh got the first go, so let's have a look and see how the game starts. Turn one, goblins. Right, let's, let's do some shooting. Yep. Um, we'll start off with some more pup launchers. 
because we like those. Um, going for Start for me. This one into them. Into the other palace guard. Okay. That's six. Last one. No, none. Um, sharp stick thrower is two attacks. So it didn't wound? No. These your goblins are useless. No, no. <laughs> Good start. Good, Good thing start. I didn't go first yeah. and use my bale of shadows. What a waste of time no, that would have been. Um, Shadow Beast onto the king. One, two, three. Three extra attacks plus one, two, three, four, five with his short bow. Oh, that annoying short bow dude. Crony is a tank. Oi! That's better. Sorry, this is into the palace guard. Yep. What's that? Five hits out of seven. Crony's uh, are cheating. Five out of eight. Wounding on on um, defense four. So three. Three wounds. Three wounds. So a better start for Groney. Most of his army's a bit tired after a night on the piss by the looks of them. Right. Um, if I roll double sixes, that would help me, wouldn't it? It would be good. Would double sixes is not a bad start. <laughs> it's a 15. <laughs> I assume that makes yes. me waving. It's an I would assume chuckle. that would make you wave it. <laughs> Look at that. I hope you got that on camera too. <laughs> I have indeed. Alright, uh, and that's my turn. Not a bad turn one. So there we have Josh's first turn. He advanced his trolls up here. The wingets advanced in behind the building here, out of sight of my dracons. He's advanced his sharp sticks and left firing lines for his war machines through them. The Mincer troop, he's got um, the wizard here and Groney has snuck into the woods and he he got that lucky wave. A good combination of the wizard with host of shadow beast plus Groney's light crossbow um, gives him quite an effective shooting attack actually. So got to watch out for that Groney. Don't estimate, underestimate him. And over here he's advancing the hordes um, and the magwons and the minces and behind them. So I was pretty lucky that turn that his war machines missed and um, only got the waiver on the palace guard. Ten lightning bolts coming downstream at Mr. G Snark Esquire hitting on fives. The, roll you, the way you roll fives and sixes is quite concerning. Oh. I started off well going into the um Well that's even changing my dice, it's not bad is it? Five Heading on wounding on defence five or defence four for defence four. Okay, then threes. Let me just get a Which could be good because I get two ones and a two. Yeah, defence four. Okay, so two wounds. Two wounds. Now, what's his nerve? Uh, he is a 12 14. Okay, I'm going to fire my sea guard at him as well. They hit on sixes, 12 dice instead of 25. I reckon I can get two sixes. I can get, oh, look at that. Two sixes. Two sixes. Two more wounds. <gasps> right, Mr. Snark. Have they snark. got piercing, do they? No. One wound. One wound. One wound. Be good if they were lightning bolts. They would be. Um, and my silver breeze get 14 dice, hitting on five, hitting on six because you're an individual. So they normally get 
Heaven. Normally, normally they get 14 dice, but they're not no steady eye. So, so they're half dice and sixes then. Uh, minus one for the woods. Minus one because individual. Minus one for individual. Hitting on four. They hit. They hit on fives. They hit on four. Ah, oh, right, right. right. So six. They quite got the the silver right. breeze in that Sorry. regard. Yeah. Um, and just to make it even interesting, they are elite ranged, hitting on fours. Oh, that's a lot of sixes. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Would you believe five sixes? Yes. <laughs> Wounding on fours. That's four wounds so oh. far. Five wounds. This is not good. Okay, any other shooting? I think that's all my shooting. I didn't realise you had that much shooting. Anyway. Silver breeds will then. What are you up to about nine? Um, eight. And four is yeah, eight. Roll again. Is 14. Is that too high? Yep. I can roll a six again. An you eight. can roll an eight. Grady Snark is dead. Woohoo! First turn. This is not good. Goodbye, Mr. Snark Esquire. Goblin's turn two. Mwah, oh, oh. Oh, that's an error. And there you go, the elf's first turn. I got really lucky with my shooting from the Silver Breeze, especially managing to destroy Grony on turn one. He could have come charging in on any of these units the next turn, really. He's got, um, I think he's got exploding dice when he hits, so each hit does a D3 wound. So he is um, a character not to be underestimated, especially when backed up by that host of Shadow Beast. So focusing all my shooting and lightning bolts on him i managed to to get rid of him so i was very happy with that for a start advanced my dracons up here near the the building out of sight here i tucked my dracon lord in behind the winget um trying to put pressure on josh um i could advance that way with him or or chase around the winget depending on what happened my general came whizzing through here He's out of line of sight of both the Trolls and the Troll Bruiser. Next turn he can pivot and try and attack one of the um, War Machines all going well. The Goblins have advanced into that wood there as well. And I advanced onto the hill except for my wavered Palace Guard back there. So um, I got lucky on my turn one and I was very happy to get rid of Grony. Let's have a look at turn two. Turn to goblins shooting. Who's going for my lance and things? Oh, the more pup. Little rotter there. Last. Four. One, two, three, four. Wounding on piercing one or two? Or? No piercing. No piercing. Oh, on defense four. Two. Two. I'm guessing on defense four, actually. I'm making this stuff up again. Um, silver Braves are defense four. Two wounds from them. Um, both of these are good. You can't start Oh, nasty. So, in first. Two. Well, now they're getting the range. Last three, three. One, two. Here's the arm um, there to be four. So one. Just one. And sharp stick thrower. Hopefully it's fives. It should be fives. No, it's fours. Oh. Last two, three. Just So last D3. That's three. Two. I knew there was piercing somewhere, uh, so don't roll ones. Three. Three, we're up to four. Ouch, that one hurt. One, two, three, four, four, six. Host Shadow Beast. On him. That another annoying character. Uh, three. Three. I guess he's got a crossbow, does he? And two. Uh, yep, short bow. Um, In concealed. And I think. We'll go for the, um, what's this? Palace Guard. 
hitting on, do you hit on fours? Usually hit on fours? Yeah. And then you moved into cover, so fives? Yes. And no piercing though? No piercing, one wound. Ouch! Up to five. Oop. Um, that's all my shooting. Um, once is first. They six. are six and two is eight. They're fine. The palace guard. Eight and five are thirteen. They're, they're fine as well. Right, turn. Ouch! Good shooting by the war machines that time. Turn two for the elves. Okay, let's get some shooting underway. I'm going to shoot the sea guard with 25 dice into your revelous rebel horde. <coughs> Hitting on fives. Um, and I've got my piercing fours. The way you roll sixes. <laughs> Gordon's trying to learn their magic too. I swear they're loaded dice. Those. <laughs> Four misses, five hits, okay. Slightly loaded. <coughs> <coughs> and then I'm going to do the same. The silver breeze are going to target them. 14 dice hitting on fours. And they've got Elite, which they don't need, because they don't roll any crappy ones. Wow. And they managed to get one, two, three out of... See, they don't always fight. Three out of five. Now, your wizard is behind a wall. Mm. I'm on a hill. Mm. I'm a height 3. Do I get my height 2? Makes me a height 5? Mm. Does the wall count? Maybe it doesn't. I'm height two. 3. Oh, you're height 3 on that? Yeah. The wall's height 1 and I'm height 5. Yeah. Wall count or not? No. Two ones, no hits with the rest. I oh, see now you've made my dice feel sad. One piercing, not good enough. No. I would have thought so. And the other wizard with the Veil of Shadows, just because she can. How many hits have I done on the Goblin Horde? Uh, eight. And I need a lot more than that to kill it. There are 19, 21. And you've still got a war machine, potentially. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to cast a lightning bolt at that Goblin Horde. Oh. Not bad. And piercing one again. Threes. One. One. Four. Everyone counts. Okay, and now on to combat. So I've got 15 dice from my general into your war machine. I hit on threes normally, but I went over a fence. Oh, sorry, do you want to roll your nerve? Oh, so nerve. Rebel. Seven. No. no. That's all the nerve checks needed. Yep. So I hit on threes, so it's a bit of a steeple chase, I'm going over the walls, so fours, 15 dice on fours. With three rolling, one miserable one, which then hits. Lots of twos and threes. Six attacks, I've got a um, crushing strength one. Defense fours or threes? Two, four, five wounds on. I can bounce them into next week. Here we go, <coughs> Kingy. Double ones! The first double ones of the day. Yep. He can fire. The whole point was to make him not fire. Inconceivable. Okay, now, to make up for that, I have 26 dice plus one die. Is the singular of dice, not dices. Being an asshole teacher in my former lives. Now, 27 dice, heading on fours from my dragons. With a re-roll of some ones. I 
I think I missed with six. And I've got a crashy one loose, the thunder. Yeah, sorry. You ended? Yeah, yeah, So I hitting on fours. Right. Well, there, there was, They're all fours. Oh, well, they think it's Sorry, I saw a four, saw a three. Oh, yeah, I'll, I'll take another one out. Right. Yeah. Okay. I'll re roll it. No, no, it's fine. Just go. It's going to die. Okay. Yeah. Okay. No, I'll, I'll be wanting double ones after this. Like, yeah, no, I'm going to re roll it because I think I've fucked that up entirely. Oh, okay. I think I was thinking I was still on three, but yeah. it should have been on fours. Whoops! I can, I can eat it today. Another three there. Another three there. Any more? I think that's me. And lose my thunder is my crushing one. Four, eight, eleven. Eleven. No. Kabawi. Well, the idea with that was to kill two war machines with one proverbial stone. Yeah, but this is the problem, isn't it? You're now in my flank. And that's the end of my turn two. Your turn, Mr. Goblin. And a bit of a close-up of that action there. So the idea being palace guard, crash into him, kill him, straight into the side of the um, Mincer troop with Nimble on it. Um, so backfired a wee bit because instead I just left myself open to a flank charge here by those goblins. But I thought it was worth a, a, a risk. If it had come off, um, I could have dealt with the king and the war machine at the same time. There's that sneaky little wizard hiding in the background there. So there we have it, the end of turn two. As you can see, the wingets moved in behind my Quicksilver Lancers. I'm just mucking around here with my with the Quicksilvers, trying to um, see what the trolls are going to do. My Dracon Lord and and other Dracons of Wisdom here, um, out of charge arcs of the troll bruiser and the sharp sticks over here my king went did a bit of a steeple chase as you saw over the fence into the war machine but unfortunately rolled a double one so it can still fire next turn which is not what the plan was i was wanting to take out two war machines if i could dracons are also um, threatening in the back line here the other dracon horde charged in here and killed the other war machine now, what we forgot to do, though, is we completely forgot there's actually a combat in here where my palace guard came charging in at the other king. The thought being, if I kill the king, I can advance through and into the flank of the um, troop of uh, mincers. Unfortunately, I failed to kill the king. So ended up instead of bouncing straight through into them and getting them in the flank i had just set my palace guard up to be flank charged by a regiment of sharp sticks instead so that kind of backfired we we um did that combat just after um i turned the video off when we realized we'd forgotten it Turn three goblins shooting in combats. There's a bit going on. First things first, wing it is going to firebomb. My sea guard. Your sea guard. Force. Last D3. There's two. Piercing. Um, any? One? Piercing one. Threes to wound. Ichini Sun. Four of those. Four. Yeah. Now Four. I'm also Four. going to pie in the sky on the same unit. So my my war machines have a leap. We'll oh. start with this fellow here. Your height five with that. Yep. yep. Cow. 
We don't need the elite. Two. Two. Last D3. Four. Four. No piercing. No piercing. Two. Two. And then there were six. And sharp six rod. Yeah, the little double one blotter. One. Last. One. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, piercing, two. piercing two. Yeah, yeah, that's a win. It's a to seven. <sighs> okay. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six. No shadow base on the king. Oh dear. One, two, two, two extra attacks. Um, nerve. So that was all my shooting, so no. Okay, so seven on them, you need a double six to wave it. No. no. That's fine. Um, no other one, no one else up with shooting? No. So combat, so we'll start with that king because two, three, four, five, seven attacks. Hindered. Yep. Fives. Okay. Banzai, has he got this? Fives. Crush one. Ooh, not bad. Oh. Now whose guys are dodgy? Uh, defense. Four. Four. Ooh. This is going to hurt. Right. Um, D6 plus 14. Ha! Four. 18. Heading on fives, Eight. charging out of the woods. 12. <laughs> right, fives. Oh, quite a few fives. It could be good night nurse, or in this case, good night wizard. Oh, there was only six after all. Yeah. Uh, crush one, yep. so Defense. threes. Four, threes. One, and four. One up to eight. See, I needed that king in there. You did need the king. Three. Is eleven probably wavered, which is slightly so less what, than nine, ten. Nine, nine, eleven. Archmage eleven thirteen. Right, plus brutal is twelve. Still wavered. Still wavered. You need a little something. Four. Right, bugger. Well, yeah, it stops oh. you charging in at me. Oh, that's a shame. Oh, it's okay. a terrible. It's a terrible shame. I don't mind that. That's all right. We can do with that. Right. Okay. Magwans. Twelve attacks. Twelve attacks. So the Magwans into my Silver Breeze over here. Twelve. Twelve attacks on threes. Yep. Oh, oh check out. Lord. Check out all those ones. That's nearly as bad as your ones at the competition. In fact, maybe it's worse than the ones. One, two. How many ones are there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven out of twelve. That's very impressive. Right. Even I can't roll that badly. Crush one with Vicious. Um, threes will wound, so four wounds. Four wounds. Puts me up to six. Which is being an elf. No. not ideal. Six and six is twelve. No. The Silver Breeze are happy as. Yes. Right. Uh, three. Oh, that's upsetting. Six. Nine. Four rabble in the side of the They're rebel. Unhindered um, rebel. Uh, sorry, sharp sticks, so fives. Yep, so we can take combat against the palace guard there. Fives. Four. Oh, sorry. They've got 15 attacks. So that makes 30. Two, three, two, three. This will teach the palace guard for not killing the king. Eight. Nine. Nine. Okay. No other fives there. Wounding on fours. Well, that makes up for the other one, doesn't it? Definitely does. One, three. two, three, four, five, six, seven. 
puts me up to 12, and the trolls still <laughs> to come charging in. Right. 36 from the trolls. And it's on um, five. Not bad. Crushing two. Crush two. Now, if you can roll seven ones again, please, that would be quite helpful. <gasps> two. So you get any more ones in it? Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I am devastated up to As it twenty. Be. If these, this, this goes double ones, I'll be very upset. I'll be. That nah, does not go double ones. We'll call it a draw then. I'm not sure what if my wizard is. Within six from there, just now. Um, That'll teach them not to kill the um, king when they had the opportunity and then charge into the We're going to go forwards up to six, three inches. And these trolls are going to reform. Combat, combat, combat. The sharp sticks. Sharp sticks into the One, dragon. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Fifteen. Did they come back out of the woods? So they did. Six sixes. sixes. Two. Lots of fives. Lots of fives. you didn't need fives, you would need another uh, five hits. What's your difference? Five. Oh, I'm alive! I didn't even get to ground you either. That was a long shot anyway. Uh, and that's turn. Okay, interesting turn three. Bring on the owls. Was it combat over there where you failed to ground? Okay, so now let's have a look, uh, a bit of an overview of what happened in that turn. So the rebel advanced over here, they're heading towards that objective. The Magwans charged into the Silver Breeze, did about six wounds, but didn't waver them. The Mincer and the King charged the Wizard trapped in here in front of the Sea Guard and only wavered him. Um, needed to get a four on the nerve check, only got a three. So that's um, so the Sea Guard. The Winget has been zooming in the back here and bombing my sea guard the palace guard it's pretty obvious that they were in trouble and sure enough they got hit by the trolls and the goblins in the flank didn't um, survive that the, the large mincer mob has turned to face my dracons over here quite happy keeping that mincer turning around and not doing too much hopefully i can keep that continuing over here the um Sharp sticks charged the Dracon Lord but failed to cause any wounds, which means that he hasn't been grounded, so he can fly off and do whatever he likes on his turn. And yep, so that is Josh's turn three. Let's see what the elves can do to respond. Turn three elves doing some shenanigans. Starting with my wizard is going to lightning bolt this annoying shit. Uh, being an elf, you don't want to see a two rolled either. Three hits. Piercing one. It's going to be maybe two wounds. So is this on the winget? On the winget, yep. Yeah, defense four. So two wounds on the winget. Another shooting from him. They can't shoot, they can't shoot. He, She's wavered. That's all my shooting. Right, we're also nerve. Double six for the win. Eight. No. Two ten could be wavered. Eleven thirteen. Oh, one short. Okay. What my dragons do? I I started shooting. I forgot to move them. <laughs> Never mind. You move them if you want. No, no. Too late now. Oops. 
they were going to turn around and, um, just in case, but there is always next turn. Okay, let's start with the Silver Breeze. They get 16 dice charging into Barry the Bruiser. And they re-roll ones, which all hit, and then they get rid of these twos. Okay, I've got Thunderous 2. Well, threes. <coughs> oh, there's a few ones, not as many as you did. I did two, and that's a very well positioned dice. Three. Okay, that's four, that's six, that's eight wounds on the bruiser. Oh, that is. Five. That's a waiver. Ah, shit. <laughs> okay, no pressure, quick silver lances, but you are dead. You're going to get trolled in the side and from the front. Okay, my king, this time against your war machine. See if he can do the job properly. Never seem to king in to do grunt work. And re-roll the ones, hitting on threes this time. Oh, now he wants to perform. So he is crushing one, so probably threes. Two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven. Right, that's devastating. Sixteen. Smeared him that time. Yes, go on. Two poops. And then the Dracon Lord is going to do the same with your other war machine. Again, re rolling ones. Ten elves in their ones. It's the best roll in the game. As long as they don't give it to other armies. <laughs> um, crushing one, thunderous one, so probably on twos. I think he's. he's Thunderous one each. Crushing one. Thunderous one. Up. So twos. Four. Six. Eight. Ten. Twelve. Eleven. They all wounded. And he's smeared. Smeared. Into next week. Smeared. Well. So he'll turn that way. He'll turn that way. Um, my sea guard. 16 dice into, oh, sorry, 25 dice heading on fours into your king. Oh. He's almost dead already too, isn't he? Yeah, I did a bit of damage on him and I have elite in combat. Which doesn't help at all. Oh, get rid of you. Just add dice to those rolls, mate. Don't, yeah, just... I'm trying. <laughs> trying to cheat as quickly as we can. And I have a, measure, a hammer of measured four, so I'm going on fours. Not as many wounds as I think. Eight. Eight, that's enough. Fourteen, that's enough to um, a couple of nerve checks. 14. One. And again, double ones. No, no double ones. Okay, and I advance one. Oh, oh, oh. Into the side of your wizard. No. Yes. No, that would be. <laughs> Into the side of your wizard. <laughs> Do I have the wizard first or you first? <laughs> wizard first. <laughs> yeah, I think you're right. Why well, didn't mind so much seeing you do it? Oh, yeah. Not a worry. Inconceivable. Okay, and 14 dice from the from the silver breeze. Into the more cup things. And the blue dice don't actually exist. Hitting on fours. And I don't get re-rolls of ones in combat. So only six. Ooh, the elves are going to take it put his damage next turn. Thunder. They've got the brew of strength. So threes to wound. Mm -hmm. Just three. This oh. is against the mag ones. The mag ones, yep. Double ones. The second double ones. The elves are trying their best to get themselves massacred. Yes. Um, and then 12 dice against the palace guard. They came out of the terrain, so they're hitting on fours against your guys there. And they re-roll the ones. And they've got a crushing strength of one. 
which they're a bit tired coming out of the bog. So wounding on threes, I'm guessing five wounds. So here's this against? Against your yep. rebel. Rebelous horde there. Yep. Now I've got 27 dice from my um can't believe it. Why don't you like the rebel? They never um, did anything to hurt anyone. I know, but they got enough human strength to, to give them your objective. Yes, they do. I know you and your, we've got unit strength up the wazoo manoeuvres. We roll those ones. And the dracons are going to be hitting on threes, which is, they've rolled about as many twos as you rolled ones before. That should be enough to kill you anyway. That should be. Um, Wounding on twos, maybe. Crushing in one thunders. Your goblins. Yep. Three, six, nine, eleven. I don't know if I rolled those or re-roll them. Ten, eleven. Right. Cool. Hiding under there. So they should be. No, I'm about twenty-five. So double ones. And then again. Halfway there. <laughs> not yeah. doing a third double one. Why not? Why not? Why would you not? Poor rabble. Poor rabble. Never did anything but no one. So done, done, done. I think that's the end of my turn. Over to you. So oh, a good turn to the elves there. Managed to wave a Barry the Bruiser which sets the Quicksilver Lancers to be charged in the flank by the trolls. It's far from ideal. The Dracon Lord took out the War Machine here. The King took out the War Machine here. The Sea Guard took out the Goblin King when they pivoted. Unfortunately wasn't able to get the Wizard quite out of the way so wasn't able to follow up. So that was two turns in a row that I tried to get onto the flank of that mincer and just failed to do it. Um, and it cost me both times, really. The Silver Breeze took out the, um, whatever they are there, the Magwons by the looks of them. And then here, a double team with the Dracons, 27 dice in the rear. Pelisgard, 12 dice in the front, destroyed the rabble. This, however, was the move that, as it turns out, um, cost me quite dearly um, in the end. The Dracons ended up here and so I reformed them so they turned to face the Mincers after I'd destroyed the Rebel. What I didn't do though, I was within three inches of this objective and at the end of the turn I didn't claim it. The Mincers have only got a unit strength of one, I've got a unit strength of two with the Dracons. As it turned out, the next couple of turns I um, ended up having to go over this way to support the rest of my army which left that that objective um, uncontested and open and I had to go back later on to try and claim it. If I'd claimed it at the end of turn three it would have made things a lot easier in the last couple of turns as you'll see later on but um, those are the kind of things you just got to keep your eye on the ball in this game. Uh, Turn for the goblins. Bring it on. Bring it. Fire bombing the. Um, the yep, the sea guns. Yep. One. Three. Three. Piercing one. Three. You. Where's lightning bolt? Ten. Ten. On the same people. One. Uh, no, you need a four to get hit with a lightning bolt. Yes. I got a six. I thought I got a three. No, I rolled three. I got a one, a three, and six. <laughs> but no wins. Um, nerve. No. Okay, so a few combats to be had. There's a, the one over there against the Quicksilver. We'll start we'll with 36 in the side of the dead beast. Next roll, guys. No hindered, unfortunately. No, no. Oh. I will teach you not to kill the bruiser. 
Look at all those Still ones. rolling a lot of ones. Hey, look at all of Keep those. that up. That's under half. It is. Um, defense? Five. Five, so, so trees. trees. Now it can roll all those ones again. It would be very handy. Oh, we've got a few. Three. We've got one, two, three. Three. Six, eight. Five, eight. And then we have Barry. Seven. What's that for? Nerve. Yeah. But, oh, it's I wavered. I wavered. Yeah. Eight and seven is fifteen. Shit, I'm wavered too. Perfect. I forgot I'm wavered, Mr. B. Bruiser Esquire. Right, trolls on fives against your Dracon Lord. Yep. Four. Okay. Wounding on threes, probably. Christian two. Three. Three wounds. I'm running out of D12 to mark my wounds. That's not a good one. Four. Four wounds. Three is seven. Um, but you're grounded. Very important. One, two. Owls are always grounded. Five. Why do we hang out in nature five, so much? Twelve. Fifteen. Uh, sharp six against your, your whizzy machine. Why whizzy? Most people Fives. don't have the audacity to target the wizards. That's not bad going for a pack of rebel. Four? Ah, uh, four, correct. Two. Two. Hey, hey, someone turned off my lightning ball. The gold. The bastards. And eleven. Oh my god. <gasps> That's a thirteen. I can count. Um, I think... You'll be inspired. I think I'm inspired, I and I'm inspired in 11, 13. Things. Should have done it the other way. I should have. Because I am inspired. Roll again. Watch me roll it again. No. Seven, nine. Nine. Um. Right. D3, D6 plus 14. Is 18 again. 18. This time you'll kill this Six, bloody wizard. Nine, 12, 15, 18. Fours this time. Yep. It's a lot of threes and twos and ones though. It is. You need to use my loaded dice. You're really good. Um, crush one. Thunderous one. So on twos. We'll call that four, shall we? Four. Puts me up to twelve by my reckoning. Yep. And one with oh, can we roll? I should have, should have done that first, anyway. Right, I'm going to overrun into your sea guard. Yep. Because that's what we do. We go bang, and then I align, yes. Now, does my phalanx work against you? Units that charge units front cannot use the thunderous charge special rule. Cavalry, large cavalry, and units with fly make an unhindered charge against this unit minus one. I'm, I'm a chariot. Mm. Yep. Okay, Mr. Show off on a chariot. Yep. This is me coming in and rolling over the top of you. No thunder slide. Fours. I'm starting to, to take a few wounds. Crush one, so Four, threes. threes. Ouch. That could be it. Four, six, seven. Okay, seven, seventeen. Um, and I've got no wizards nearby. Eight. Gone. Kaput. Oh, that was good. <sighs> Did its job, didn't it? Well and truly. I didn't need that to happen just then. I think we're going to go for a reform. I'll, uh... Oh, la la. Ouch. I'm in a world of hurt, I think. Right, um, 12 attacks. Four. 
Right. The deck there 12. Mm -hmm. Meg ones. On four? On threes. Threes. Mm. Crush one. So on threes, threes again. Threes. Uh, we roll in ones. Six or up to twelve, they could be gone too. And they are seven. Very oh, nice. I am melting. That was a good turn for you. Um, I don't appear to have much left on this side of the table. Really? Oh, that's just such a shame, isn't it? I could have had that woods cleaned up. <laughs> Along with the rest of the army. Mm. Anyway. Right, end of turn. And I think I might pick up a victory point. Oh, I'd show off. <laughs> Your turn. Yikes! A successful turn for Josh. That turn wing it, fired at the sea guard, then the mincer after killing the wizard, who was my inspiring wizard, then charged into them and destroyed it. Finally, the um, Magawans killed the Silver Breeze, and I wasn't able to have an inspiring because he was already dead, and over here he wavered the Quicksilvers. So another good turn there to Josh. Let's see what I can do in response. To be doing okay, you'd need some units left alive, and I'm quickly running out of unit strength. The team what's going to be most upsetting for you is when these trolls survive. Those trolls are not going to survive. He can't cast because he was wavered. Was it? No, you hit me. You turned off my lightning bolt. I've got no one else that has the audacity to try and shoot, so I'm going to start there against your trolls. Five dice from my general, uh, my dragon lord. One, two. Before we'll take six because that's how we roll. Uh, hitting on threes, three, crushing one, fours, wound, one wound. Okay, so now I'm going to get 18 guys from the, the dracons, and you could survive. Your prediction can come true here. So they only have nine attacks, they do right. 18 from the flank. Yep. Quite handy, actually. I didn't rate them too highly. I preferred the, the horde, but be able to zoom along and then turn. I can, I can see the advantage of a nimble. What do they hit on? Threes or They hit on threes. That's Crushing one, thunderous one. So threes to wound. And that's a good roll of. Three. Wow. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, thirteen. That's unbelievable. Really? Oh, this is not good. Eight. Yeah, okay, they go on. Mate, geez, they... They hit like a truck from the flank. Where are you going to go? I think you're going to keep facing that way, just in case. Now! General Moucher, is Barry the Bruiser considered to be a monster? Uh, he'll be large infantry. Because my my axe of giant slaying gained, I gained the Slayer rule. Which surprisingly enough isn't on here. I think there's a you got the the book. I think Slayer's Going to apply. I hope it does. Oh, and you know what I should have done? But I didn't. I can't turn because I'm locked in anyway. Slayer. When attacking an enemy, large infantry, monstrous infantry, large cavalry, monster attack. And I am large infantry, so yes. You get awesome, so I, get a D so I get an extra two. So I get two attacks. Seven, 21 dice. No. You're an individual. 
Yeah, I'm an individual. That would be really cool. If only I was an ogre. Where are the ogres when I need them? Four. I thought that was brilliant. You get seven. <laughs> All the kids out there just ignore me when it comes to learning the rules. Oh, 21 would have been awesome. Yeah, what would, do you do rolling be, twos? Would be great. Four. <laughs> Crushing one. Uh, three. Three. That's still good. Yeah. Takes me up to nine. Okay. Baron's got to die. Don't think he's going to. No. No. He is wavered still. He good. He didn't have to waver him. Just. Again. And unfortunately, <clears throat> I'm going to lose my quicksilvers. Yep. So, dun, 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 dun. Over to the palace guard. Yep. Ooh. Yep. If I don't like this, you might kill my magwans. Nice. Because if I don't, there could be a chariot coming right in the rear. <sighs> Look at all those ones. Glorious ones. Reroll those. Nine hits. Crashing one. Threes. What do you mean threes? Threes. I rolled. I got five by the looks of that. Right. Your takes me to eight. I need to roll no double ones. Come on, roll high. Yeah. You want me to keep that one? Oh, it was fine. It's up to you. 12, 14. That would kill them. Yeah, we'll keep that. Anyway, no. No worries, Mr. Um, Palace but you do have to worry about those guys and those guys. And those guys are within 10. I go there, yeah. You're dead. <laughs> <laughs> Double mincer, that would be a first. That is, by the looks of it, end of my turn. I managed to get a wee bit of revenge. My palace guard killed the magwans, but then they're set up to be charged from here or from here, which is far from ideal. My dracons and dracon lord killed the trolls over here, and I also managed to waver the bruiser, the troll bruiser again. So happy with that but things are definitely in the balance. Turn oh, five. Oh, sorry, shooting, shooting. Shooting first, you've still got your... Three firebombs. At my wizard? Yes, at your wizard, yep. You can just, it's just three, his boots are going to be left. Two, three. One, two, three, four, five, piece one. Three. Ha! Only four. Four no, wounds. Six. Any other shooting? Yep, uh, Wiz Lightning Bolt 3, 1, TC 1, 1. 7! You really don't like my oh, wizard. I want to kill that thing. Why don't you... 12. 12. Wavered, at least. Surely. Wavered again. Surely. Wavered! 11, 13. It was a 12. Yep. <sighs> right. Oh, and um, fire bombs now called shattering as well. <laughs> that would be nice, wouldn't it? Yes, it's a, it's a that new, would be a real pain in the arse. Yeah, yeah. It'd be yeah. nice if they actually came up with a shattering spell. Yeah, that would be. You heard it here first, folks. Mm. Shattering spells for the win. The next, right. next update, Clash of Kings 2023. Shattering spells for the win. Well, you could just, Telling you now, you could just do damage and then and then it's it's a wound. <laughs> that also works. It's kind of a waste of a spell, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> However, up, upgrade for the wing it. Um, yeah. Yeah, that's Time, what I mean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Shattering yeah. on it. Yeah. Because they're so underrated, no one does. No, them. that's they right. No one them. Them. I, I they think, need to be boosted. Yeah, yeah. I think yeah, I think so. Yeah, yeah. So the um, the ramming speed one is brutal, and. <laughs> And the flying one needs I'll, I'll give Rampage to the other one. The precedent's been set. Yep, right. Why not? Um, 36 dice from the trolls in the side of your knits um, on fours. Okay. And I'm going to make you roll it. I'm running down the clock, folks. You've got to roll it. 
Look at all those not good rolls. There's not that many ones. There's lots of twos. Twos are not ones. There's lots of twos. Look at them all. Look at all those uh, twos and ones. Good. What's that? But you've still got more than enough to flatten Six, my quicksilvers. 9, 12, 15, 16. Just a bit under, isn't it? Yeah. Right, uh, you are defense is five, five, so, so three. three. So you're just going to crush them like tin cans. I hope so. Oh, oh that was an unlucky reroll. It's still enough to potentially devastate me. Three, six, nine, ten. Ten Nine and eight ten. is eighteen, devastating. Boom! No rerolls there, no. No. Great. Um, and we'll just do a little reform like that. And you know what, end of my turn, I might just pick up that victory token. Is it the end of the turn or the end of the move? It's the end of the turn. But, ah, oh, shit. Here we go, man. That's me trying to be dodgy again, folks. Three, six, nine. Who's? Four, oh, that's your goblins. Fifteen. Fifteen, 15 on to the, the Dracons. Dracons for the win. Fives. One, two, three, four, five. Fives. Two. Two, two words. Ouch. Grounded. Ouch. Eight and ten. Fuck okay, it, I think I'm... Um, I think I'm wavered. No. Yeah, yeah, we're not very tough. Oh, 12, 14, not mm. 10, 12. Yeah, that's good. Mm. D6 plus 14. Oh, 15. 3, 6, 9, 12, 15. Unfall. Thunderous one, crush one. Twos or threes? Uh, thunderous one, crush one. I'm a four, so twos would be very. Three, six, seven. Seven eight. puts me at ten, and that's them well and truly screwed just as well. Seven, just eight. Bang! Bang! Right, um. Um. See, people watch. People watch out for this. I mean, so this one here, but it's actually this one here you've got to worry about. He's nasty. Mm. He's great. Um, do I want him in combat or do I just want to go pick up a point? We're nearing the end of the game, bottom of turn five or top of turn five, depending on. I've got one more turn, I'm not going to get him into combat. He's going to move forward five Ooh, inches. Oh, and he might grab it. Let's hope so. He's going to be just out. Right. Um, and that, sir, is my turn. You're um. up. <sighs> okay, that's a pretty good turn. Turn five for the elves, coming up. Didn't get a photo at the end of the goblin's turn unfortunately but over here the trolls had killed the quicksilver lancers the mincer mob had killed the palace guard and then turned to face and he had wavered my wizard over here and the goblins had marched over this way to um, claim the center objective and the other goblins were engaged over here against the dracon so Good turn for Josh. He's um, focusing on getting his tokens now, and I think he's got them all at this stage, and is also contesting this one. Me failing to take that one before has really come back to um, cause me problems. If I can get rid of these goblins, I can claim this one here, and I had claimed my third one um, earlier. So I can get this one. I should be able to get the Dracons over there if necessary to grab that one this one here was about to be claimed by josh as well so um he's winning at present but i've still got a chance
<laughs> Try killing chopsticks, what am I thinking? I should have seen the other guys, no, I couldn't see the other guys in the flank. These guys moved around here, they could have gone in the flank, they didn't because I actually need to get an objective down over here. So, with that in mind, let's move on to, and he can't really do anything because he's wavered. He could, oh, he could go backwards. Three, and I think he will. I'm going to kill that Wiz. This I know. Turn. Oh, he's already lying down, he's tired. Mm -hmm. Okay, shooting. None. None. <laughs> okay, and to bury the bruiser, three extra attacks. Now we're going, going to get him because you failed to regenerate. I did, I failed. Five, eight dice from the Elven King. Rerolling the ones. Ah, good thing that's a wasted oh, double okay. one. Um, so, one, two, four, six hits. Crashing one. No, there was a two there. Fours. Three more. Right, I'm on 12. I've got to get him this time. And again. Come on, Barry. Die for the cause. Thank you, so Barry. I'm one and I was hopeful. And I charge forward, hoping to annoy your trolls. You probably do annoy my trolls. Which is most upsetting. Which is what I needed to do to yes, block you. Hey, I love it when a plan comes together. I really didn't want that. Okay, so my Dracons get nine dice. But Sorry, are you... Oh, you I, that wasn't an individual, so you can't, yeah. Yeah, you're just there. Uh, yeah, are I'm, you mighty? I am. I'm mighty good, big enough. I clean my teeth every day and everything. And I sharpen my ears to get them really pointy. Mm. I'm good at killing trolls. Okay, so I get nine dice. I hit on threes. You've got spears. So yep. that hinders me. Yep. And I lose the thunderous as well. Yep. Yep. What was I thinking, charging... Goblins in the front. Spears, I know, in that's the front. right. That's right. With a Unfortun flying unit. Unfortunately, yep, so fours. If I've gone in the flank, I was away from the objective I need to get to. And re-roll two ones. Oh. Which means eight, seven hits. Oh, man, how do you do that? The cheating dice. <laughs> These dice are loaded. You always use those yellow ones, and he really has to make a roll. Ah. Uh, Crush one threes. Oh, now I've rolled three ones though, that makes up for it. Four. Four wounds. Four wounds, which isn't going to be enough. But I could get really lucky. Don't get really, three don't get really lucky. is seven altogether. Okay, that is the end of the elf turn. Five objectives. I ran away from this one. Silly mistake. You've still got unit strength there. Contesting that one, unfortunately. You've grabbed your other ones, but you're about to grab that one. Turn six for the goblins. Can I pull off a draw? Same photo as last time. My um, king finally killed off Barry the Bruiser and then advanced as far as he could, touching these um, trolls, a sacrifice to allow me to try and grab this objective um, by dealing with the goblins. Unfortunately, the dracons struggled because the um, spears were quite effective versus the flyers in that particular turn. The dracons over here, out of charge range um, of the mincer, but actually their job was to fly over here on turn six and grab this objective if they could, um, as long as Josh didn't move over there. So yeah, that was where we were at the end of that turn. Okay, right. turn six. He's just hit my wizard with a firebomb here. Yep. Just roll, roll for blast. Yep. So I've got three. Yep. Um, and piecing one. So mm -hmm. threes. I'm not scared. I'm an elf. I can. Two. Two more wounds. Ha! Up to nine. Now no, I flesh I don't. One. Your dracons are. Oh, was it the Dracons, or who was it? No, no, that was the wizard, but, yep. but I can't see you because your Dracons are Yeah, my right? Dracons are hope 4. So oh, no, going... hope 4, 3, you can, because he's he's going to be a 3 plus 2. Okay. You can see his head sticking up, going, his ears, the lightning top of bolt. his ears. <gasps> two, two lightning bolts, one at each ear. 
One more wound. Oh, oh, oh. to be double one. That'll... How about boxcars? Yeah, how about... <laughs> he really did. <laughs> um, okay. Two, four, six, eight, nine, twelve, fifteen. Look at this. Sharp sticks into dracons. That's the uh, 21 four would be my reckoning. No, I re-roll it. That, that, was, that wasn't that a ghost roll. It doesn't count. It See? Yeah, but it rolled another one. See? The elves have the mean? sportsmanship five. award. Five. We're only on five. Two. Two. Up to four. Luckily I've got a guy nearby. But you could still wait for me. What was your um... 12, 14. That's way too know. high. That's way too high. Rolling, That's like a 15. That again? You are, because he's saying, fuck off, Damn goblin. It. I really want a waiver here. Because the waiver it. wins me the game. I know. Seven. Four, four 11. 11. One short. Oh, one short, you need an eight. Don't, don't show up six so brutal. <laughs> <laughs> oh. 10, 15, 17, 18. Oh, against um, Kingy. Yes, Kingy. Kingy with my trolls. Ooh. On fours. Look at all those sixes, though, isn't it? Look at that. Makes up for those hundreds of ones. That's right. So, defense? Five. Five, so three. Three. Oh, Whoa, lots of ones and twos. Wow, and one more. Only five. five. I can wear that as if. Right, uh, 11. It's 16. No, that's really high. You're inspiring, but you. I am, I'm a king. Damn it. I think I'm great. Uh, 10. 15. I'm still <laughs> fucked. <laughs> Perfect. Right, we're going to advance six. One. One. One, one miserable. One is it's not what we wanted. It's not what we wanted. One, we wanted. One, one, one. Trolls can't count, that's your problem. They have no concept right. of and numbers. And that's us. Ha. My turn. Call that a turn six. Narrow win, not. Turn six. The elves couldn't do much except try and draw the game. Just as close as they ever get to winning. Okay, so my general. Flying guy, seven, he gets ten dice. Has he got anything useful? I don't think I've given him any items. No. Oh, oh Rampage. Rampage is going to work, isn't it? Mm. Sure. Infantry. Yep. Another three attacks. Oh, look at that. That's, like, that's 16. Mm. Why haven't I been sending him against infantry? I don't know. He's awesome. And the twos are gone, and the reroll and the ones. That's more like it. Now we've remembered how to kill things. Crushing one, thunderous one. No poxy little spears to worry me. Oh no! Look at all the wins. Twos wound though. Mm. I'm assuming. Crushing and yes, thunderous. Yeah, yep. would, yep. Two, four, six, eight, nine. Right, that puts you into 13. Now you can roll more, but I am at 12, 14. Oh, so roll double it. ones. The... You sure? Yeah. Oh, oh, yes. Oh, Come my. On. Come on. <sighs> right. Don't roll the dice. <laughs> it gives you a heart attack Go every on. time. And now you can get to pick up that. And the, the um, generals. Going to go um, it's sideways. One. He's in range anyway. And he's collecting that one. And these guys are going that way in case there is another turn, in which case I hopefully can draw. Wow. Okay. Have you won it for three, or is it going to be a draw? This dice will determine all. Good game. Well played. Good game. Do you want to play out a, a, the next turn just? There you have it.
a very closely fought 4 3 victory to the Goblins. If we were using the Northern Kings scoring, there was quite a difference in our scores, though. It would have ended up a 23 10 to the Goblins um, due to the extra points for winning um, and the differential in the number of units killed. But a good close game. Thoroughly enjoyed it. Another one of those games of what could have been with the Elves. My win-loss ratio um, is not too flash at present with the Elves, but I do feel I'm getting um, better at using them, and I feel they're a lot more competitive now that I'm taking the Dracon um, regiments with Nimble to get around flanks and stuff. It's just a matter of still not combining two units to hit um, the target unit enough. Maybe I'm been playing ogres too long in that regard where one unit often can deal with the opponents um, without too many worries. Raise is a mission that I really do um, like. All the games I, I enjoy with Kings of War though and I hope you en enjoyed that. The, it's the banter and the laughter at the, the table that um, is the main reason I war game. It's a hobby after all and so thoroughly enjoyed um, the game first Josh. We had a bit of a laugh. Um, commiserated when the dice went a bit crappy um, etc thing that cost me in this game right here the objective on turn three if i had burned that one when i should have i wouldn't have had to redeploy my dracons on turn four five and six to come around this way instead they would have been able to take out this last unit of goblins which ended up controlling this pivotal center um objective so that was a bit of a major mistake on my behalf i realized as soon as I started moving on turn four that i had cocked up there but i was hoping to be able to recover um we both had the odd unlucky waiver and things but that's just the, the bounce of the dice when you're rolling lots of dice sometimes they swing one way sometimes they swing the other but i think we both had opportunities i like um playing josh's army i find it challenging um i was really glad i got rid of groney early on but he out deploys me by about four units so that's four units that i have to chew through without losing too many of my own um if i'm going to do okay and as you could see that turn i think it was turn three when i lost um two or three units down in this area really swings quite quickly against the elves in those kind of situations so um, I find that my army really is a wee bit of a, a glass hammer at times. I am contemplating getting rid of the Sea Guard and trying a Dracon Horde instead and just going for more mobility and probably turning it into a wee bit of an Alpha Strike. But I do try, like trying to use the Sea Guard as a base for the rest of my units to try and manoeuvre off. I was wanting to actually be a bit more aggressive with the Sea Guard as as well start marching them forward didn't really achieve it this game um, but that's something that i do want to keep working on as well but anyway hope you enjoyed it hope it gave you a bit of an insight into into the fun and laughter that we have at the table um good good humid banter all the the time when i play against gordon and and josh and that's why i enjoy playing kings more than any other reason really um yeah, I hope you've liked this this new format. I've got a new camera, so that takes a bit better photos, and it, and I'll put it on a tripod. Um, haven't tried live stream or anything like that, but yeah. Anyway, thank you very much. I'll maybe just finish with a few lessons learnt. So let's move on to that. Few of the lessons learned. Focus on the winning conditions. I failed to claim that objective on turn three when I should have, and that really did cost me the game. Two, I need to focus on trying to set up multi charges. The elves often need more than one unit hitting the target if they're going to succeed, which means making use of the mobility of the dracons and the dracon lords, especially. The king I'm quite happy with is a war machine um, type chaser. He zooms around the battlefield, and I'm really quite happy with how he does that. Three, don't take char a charge just because you can. The Quicksilver Lancers charging at um, the Troll Bruiser by themselves mm, probably should have come off, but didn't. And there was a couple of other charges against individuals um, that I, I made also that didn't kind of 
going my way but I saw the opportunities there and gave them a crack but again um, maybe being a wee bit more cautious about when I'm going to charge and not charge uh, things I need to work on struggling to get wins at present with the elves but thoroughly enjoying playing with them so I'm going to persevere keep making little wee tweaks to the list here and there but I actually really enjoyed this version of it um, that I used today so I'll give that a few more runs in future we've got Oamaru Onslaught coming up this weekend and on the TO and it looks like I'll probably be umpiring rather than playing but who knows I may um, end up having a little late cancellation and having to make up numbers we'll just have to wait and see but um, yeah that's all hope you enjoyed the battle report um, I'm enjoying making them and, and going over my my lists and things so they're mainly for my benefit but if other people find them enjoyable that's a bonus so thanks very much ka kite anō